When it comes to DJ laptops, most people immediately think of the Apple MacBook. This is an expensive machine that was never ever designed with DJs in mind, especially the later models with those USB Type-C ports. On the other hand though, Windows machines have always been full of bloatware, either too business focused or too gamer focused to ever put audio front and center. However, that's all changed with the release of this, the XMG DJ15. And today, we're gonna to take a closer look. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Holland and today we're taking a closer look at this, the XMG DJ15. Now, it's important to note this laptop is only available in Europe at the time of recording this video. And also this laptop, whilst I say it's all about audio performance, it's specifically about DJ performance, not necessarily uh, production performance. In this video, I'm not gonna go too nerdy with the specs. I'm not gonna bore you with what latency means and all that. If you want to learn more about that, XMG have some incredible tutorials and, and explanations of their own. Plus fact, I myself and the guys from XMG, no doubt, will be in the comments below answering any further questions. If you do want to know about the specs inside this test unit, I'm gonna have them pop up just here for you. So you can hit the space bar and take a look at the specs. What I will say is it's all very high quality Samsung stuff. We've got uh, temp gen i7 processor in there as well. So, is this laptop as good as everyone makes out? Is this the best laptop for DJs? Let's take a closer look and find out. The XMG DJ15 is available in either a red or a silver finish. Both feature an aluminium lid and top case with resin being used on the base and bezel. The chassis feels very nice to the touch, however there is a bit of depth flex around the trackpad and also on the screen. Weighing in at just 1.6 kilograms, this laptop is impressively light especially to say it's a 15 inch model. The hinge feels reassuringly tight, however it does mean one-handed opening is virtually impossible. Speaking of the display, the matte finish anti-glare panel is absolutely ideal for use in dark clubs. It handles moving beams of light with no issues and there is no glare to worry about. The 1080p panel isn't the sharpest, nor is it the brightest, however at this price point we're not complaining. The surrounding bezels are nice and thin, except on the bottom, where sadly the DJ15 develops a bit of a chin. On the upside though, this is the perfect place to put a sticker. Branding opportunities don't stop there either. The XMG DJ15 can come with a custom logo printed on the back. Ideal for DJs wanting to maximise their branding, this option isn't available on the online configurator. However, you can email XMG directly and they will walk you through the process. The Chiclet full-size keyboard features a dedicated number pad. The keys feel solid, even at the edges, with plenty of travel. Being laser etched, the characters allow the backlight to shine through, ideal for DJing in dark environments. The backlight of the keyboard can be changed between 27 colours, which probably looks great on the silver model. However, on our test model, the red one, only white really complemented. Finally, the large trackpad with gesture support feels fantastic. Responsive to the touch, intuitive to use, the Windows Precision drivers feel very close to the MacBooks at this point. The trackpad's inbuilt fingerprint reader allows for a very, very quick login, with the machine booting from cold to the desktop in under 20 seconds. Sadly, there is no Windows Hello option on this laptop at the moment. Possibly the best asset of the XMG DJ15 is the connectivity. Making MacBook users everywhere jealous, there's a port for almost every professional DJ's needs. First up, we have two USB 3.0 ports. These are ideal for exporting tracks from Rekordbox to a USB port. If your USB device is a bit funny about your connection speed, there is an older USB 2.0 port as well. And finally, there's a brand new USB Type-C port with support for Thunderbolt 3, DisplayPort and charging, should you forget the included 65 watt barrel plug. A dedicated headphone port is found on the other side, which can be used with headsets. The microphone input also doubles as a SPDIF digital output as well, ideal for audio files that want to connect an external DAC. Finally, there's a 6-in-1 card reader, an Ethernet port, a full-size HDMI port, and DisplayPort 1.2. With a wide variety of ports on offer, this laptop really does make dongles and adapters a thing of the past. Regardless if you DJ using Pro DJ Link, USBs, SD cards, or a controller, there's a connection for absolutely everybody on the XMG DJ15. 
In the pursuit of ultimate audio performance, the team at XMG have meticulously built and tested various combinations of hardware from their extensive catalogue of suppliers. Once the best hardware combination had been found, the next task was to build a version of Windows that prioritised audio performance above everything else. Included with the DJ15 is a version of Windows 10 Pro, and we're thankful to say this is completely bloat-free. There's no unwanted Candy Crush Saga to uninstall, there's no seven-day free trial of an antivirus system you've never heard of, and these changes aren't just skin-deep either. The whole operating system is tuned for the hardware it has been installed on. Combined with a custom BIOS, this ensures ultra-low, stable latency out of the box, even when running on the battery or leaving the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth turned on. So what are our thoughts on the XMG DJ15? Well, over the last few months, we've been testing it in various scenarios. Overall, we've been very impressed with the laptop and the performance it offers. Powered by 10th gen Intel processors and running high quality Samsung memory and storage, this machine was never going to be slow. Still, the immediacy of which tasks are completed is noticeable. Stripped back, bloat-free Windows is very refreshing to see on a brand new laptop. So it's something that Mac users have enjoyed for years. The large cooling vents on the laptop's base keep the machine running very cool and we experience no thermal throttling throughout our testing. The fans never seem to spin up for long as a result, although that said, they aren't exactly the quietest when they are activated. The under the hood changes made to this laptop are hard to see in day-to-day -day DJing unless you know how to push the system. And even when you push the buffer limits to their absolute limit, you still don't hear a difference. That's how good this laptop is. Everything just seems to work flawlessly. Throughout our months with this laptop, we've never been able to make it hiccup whilst DJing, even with the most obscene setups. However, nothing is perfect, and the XMG DJ15 is no exception at all. The integrated stereo speakers found in either corner of the base are absolutely terrible, a real weak link for a laptop built around audio. The 1080p display, although superb at handling nightclub lights, is a tad dim when working in daylight. The low resolution also leaves the display lacking sharpness, especially on DJ applications that use smaller fonts. Driving that display is sadly integrated graphics with no dedicated GPU on board. Day-to-day -day use, this probably won't be an issue for most users. However, if you want to get into streaming sets or video DJing, you might find that you'll need a laptop with more graphical power when pushing for more performance. And there we have it, the DJ15 by XMG. At just over a thousand euros with a terabyte SSD and 16 gigabytes of RAM, this machine is incredibly well specced for its price point. Sure, the chassis isn't as nice as something like a MacBook Pro or a Dell XPS, but then again, it's half the price of those models. On top of that, we've got that fully custom-built BIOS, the tuned version of Windows 10 Pro, and the whole thing just handles audio tasks so well. Honestly, I've never been able to get a laptop to run buffer sizes as small as this and not hiccup whatsoever, even when Wi-Fi and Bluetooth were left on. If you're in the market for a day-to-day -day laptop and then going to do a bit of DJing on the side, this probably isn't the model for you. The speakers and the screen just aren't good enough. However, if you've already got a day-to-day -day machine and you're just wanting the best possible performance when you go out and DJ, this wins all day long. All I'm waiting for now is a version with a better graphics card on it so I can stream and I prefer a 13-inch size myself. But that's my personal views on the laptop. What are yours? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for, the, for taking the time to watch this video and we'll see you in another video sometime soon. Take care.